Hi, my name is Lawrence Jay and I'm the director at Rolling Ridge. I trust that you are appreciating our weekly Take Your Time Tuesday videos and taking time for yourself to slow down and to be spiritually centered during these challenging times. For this week's Take Your Time Tuesday video, I want to introduce you to the spiritual practice of retreat. At the Ridge, we tend to use retreat as a noun, as a time to get away, but imagine with me retreat as a verb. Imagine a war and the front lines of battle, weary soldiers overwhelmed by the enemy, chaos, confusion, losses, death. An officer yells, retreat, retreat, retreat. And everyone turns around 180 degrees and hightails it out of there and escapes to safety, to find rest, to take stock, to make a new plan. To retreat as a verb is to make a change, to turn, to find a safe place. In our world today, we face challenging battles on the front line of our lives as we war against a pandemic, fight injustices, face the forces of confusion and chaos as we confront loss, disappointment, and death. With all that overwhelms, do you hear the voice of God? That still small voice of the divine within that says, retreat, retreat, retreat. As you heed the call, to retreat means you stop what you are doing, make a change, turn around, and hightail it out of there to a place that is safe so you can renew and rest. Is it, it is a spiritual battle. We all need time to escape the battle, to rest, to allow our wounds to heal, to be still with ourselves and with God, to take time to think and reflect to find that emotional and spiritual space so that we can return to the front line of our lives, strong, refreshed with new energy, ready to face the challenges. With all that we are facing today, now more than ever, we need to retreat. And so, how do we retreat? We can retreat daily through quiet times with practices that spiritually refresh us. These Take Your Time Tuesday videos are intended to introduce you to spiritual practices so that you can retreat for a few moments each day. Lectio Divina, Visio Divina, Mindfulness, Embodied Gratefulness, Breath Prayers, Nature Contemplation. These are some ways you can retreat daily, even if for only a few minutes. I know that over the past four months, when people ask me how I'm doing, I tell them it all depends what side of the bed I get up from in the morning. My daily times with God and Lectio Divina through scripture have been so important for me in choosing the right side so that I am not overwhelmed by fears and doubt, but can face the day's challenge with hope and faith. Along with retreating every day through a spiritual practice, another way to retreat is to set aside a day for rest. Often this is called Sabbath, and we'll be talking more about Sabbath in a Take Your Time Tuesday video next month. But at Rolling Ridge, we offer our day apart retreats as an opportunity to get away from the busyness of our front line for a day and to spend some time tending to our soul. A selected topic focuses the content of the day, whether on spirituality, eco-spirituality, or our connectedness with the earth, wellness, art. Rolling Ridge offers a variety of topics to speak to the diversity of needs within our community. Currently, our retreats meet online, but with the Rolling Ridge property now reopened, we invite you to return to our grounds for a day or an overnight and to log into one of our online retreats while here. In other words, we invite you to get out of your house and come to our house as you retreat to the quiet beauty of Rolling Ridge online while on site. No kitchen clutter, no distractions, no interruptions, just you and God 
our historic mansion and 38 acres of lakeside forests and trails, an outdoor labyrinth and gardens. If none of our current topics interest you, or if you prefer to retreat with no structure, the ridge is still open and ready for you to come. We have space for personal retreats for just a day or an overnight, two or three nights or more. You can use your time however you wish, or we can work with you to make your time at the Ridge a personally directed retreat if you'd like to meet with one of our trained spiritual directors while here. Having been sheltered in place for over four months now, you may simply need to get out of your home and retreat to a place like Rolling Ridge to rest, renew, and refocus, so to return ready to face the challenges on your front line. To retreat is a spiritual practice because it will not happen unless you make a change in how you spend your time and choose to do it. You need to stop what you are doing, turn and get out of there. I encourage you this week to retreat daily with a spiritual practice, but I also encourage you to make plans for a longer retreat, a day, an overnight, or a few overnights. For more information on retreating to Rolling Ridge, check the information on our website or in the information below this video. Remember, a retreat may be a noun as it is a time to get away, but to retreat is a verb as your heart turns from the busyness of life and moves towards God. As you make plans for a retreat, may you take time each day to retreat and know that a retreat is not so much a destination as it is your heart moving towards the heart of God. Amen.